Right, so stage eight starts right here, Ride Seafront. Just had a photo call with the stage sponsors. Now we're gonna go check out the course. After the starting ride, 19.1 kilometers into the stage, we reached Braiding Down, one of the highest points on the island and the first difficulty of the day. Oh, it's a bit tough up there, but yeah, beautiful views. If the brake hasn't gone by this point, it's gonna be a really tough moment in the race. Across the downs. So this is where the race gets interesting. The race has come down a steep descent onto Ventnor Beach, onto the Esplanade. Beautiful views today, <laughs> load, of, load of people on the beach. It's, as you can see, super narrow road. First switchback, don't go over the edge. It's where the gradient really starts to bite. First really steep corner. You see the gradient there. That's, on the inside of the corner there, it's gotta be 25%. The thing about this climb is, there's not really a descent afterwards. If anybody does lose position, it's gonna be really difficult to come back. Zigzag road for a reason. Head out across the military road. So the start is probably the steepest part of the needles climb. Up off the car park, the road gets smaller through the gate. Often it's headwind here. Look off to the right, taking the view. The gradient isn't that bad, but it makes the small road means you're not in good position, you get caught out, and surely somebody's gonna attack. Try and get ahead before the steepest section. Pace is really fast here, it's almost flat. Yeah, hopefully the conditions are like this on race day, because it's actually quite, there's very little wind today, and it's, yeah, big chain ring, super fast. The steepest section of the climb there. This is really where the race is gonna be won. This 200 meter-ish, I want to say 250 meters between the two switchbacks would have been perfect finish for me. Yeah, very much big chain ring. And flat to the finish line. That was a needles climb. Obviously it's spectacular place to finish the Tour of Britain for 2022. I'm sure to be an amazing stage. You know, it's uh, testing, beautiful, dramatic, and uh, well, just hope for a day like this.